Hi guys, this is Maria from Kodak and today I'm going to show you how to set up a referral program in your WooCommerce store so you can easily engineer word of mouth and pave your path to sustainable business growth. But before we dive into the nitty gritty, make sure you already have a WooCommerce store set up and you have added some good products that your customers would find absolutely irresistible not to share with their peers. Given that you have ticked all of the above, let's dive right in. So the first thing you need to do is install the referral system plugin in your WooCommerce store. It's a premium plugin that can be purchased from the official WooCommerce extension store. It's developed in-house by a product team at Kodak and is regularly updated and tested. We've also prepared and maintained a detailed documentation that documents all of its features and all of its possible configurations. Find the link in the description below and grab the plugin before you go ahead. Okay, let's start with the plugin installation process. When you purchase the plugin, you receive a zip file in your inbox. Store that zip file as is somewhere on your computer. You'll need to upload the zip file in WooCommerce to install the plugin. To install the plugin, go to your WooCommerce store and open the WordPress dashboard. Navigate to plugins, add new, upload the plugin. Choose the plugin file you purchased. Click install now to install the plugin. With the plugin installation done, now's the time to set up a magical campaign that starts attracting referral customers to your business and gives your sales and revenues a good kick. To configure your plugin settings, open your WordPress dashboard and navigate to WooCommerce. Settings. Open the Referral System tab over here. You'll see a bunch of options here. But before I walk you through them, it's important to understand the different kinds of referral rewards you can set up with this plugin. You can offer two types of referral rewards a sign up based reward. So if a customer refers their friend and their friend signs up on your website, both the referrer and the referee get a coupon in their inbox, which they can use for any future orders they place on the website. An order-based reward. So if a customer refers their friend and their friend places an order on your store, both the referring parties receive a discount coupon in their, in their inbox, which they can use for any future orders placed. The good thing about this plugin is that it allows you to set up both the different types of referral rewards on your store. Another unique referral reward you can offer with this, with this plugin is loyalty points. However, if you want to offer loyalty points as referral rewards, you need the WooCommerce points and rewards extension installed and activated on your site as well. The referral system plugin integrates with the WooCommerce points and rewards extension and lets you offer loyalty points as referral rewards, a unique feature that will give your referral campaign an edge above your competition. With that said, let's dive in the plugin settings. First, we have got some general settings here. I'll walk you through each of them one by one. First, we have the option to select the type of functionality. You have two options here. The first option lets you offer discount coupons as referral rewards, while the second one lets you offer loyalty points as referral rewards. Note, it, note that you can do both. If you choose the second one, you won't be able to set up the discount coupons. I'm choosing the first one here just to show you how to set up discount coupons before I move on to integrate with WooCommerce points and rewards extension. Next, we have some slug settings. Changing the settings here will change the structure of your referral link. Then we have the option to set cookie expiry. Let me explain you how the cookie system works. So when a customer shares a referral link with someone, and if that referee visits your website, but doesn't order right away or doesn't sign up right away, they'll still be able to avail the referral reward if they come back within the number of days we have set here, without even using the referral link. If they come back after this cookie is expired, they'll have to use the referral link to avail the reward. Then we have some redirect rules. Here you can change which, which page or product you want the referral link to direct to. Then we have some pretty basic customization options. Here you can customize the text that shows up when someone shares the referral link. Let's save the settings here and move on.
Let's configure the sign up based rewards. Here, the first option is to enable or disable this type of reward. It's highly recommended that you enable it to offer a good incentive for people to enroll in your referral program. Then we have the option to select the coupon type. We have two options here, the fixed price and percentage. If you, if you select the fixed price coupon and say you enter 50 in the coupon amount field, your referring parties will be receiving a discount coupon that offers them $50 off when they use the voucher on your store. If you choose percentage here, the referring parties will be receiving a discount coupon that rewards them 50% off when they use the voucher on your store. Finally, you have the uh, coupon settings broken down into two parts, the coupon for referral and the coupon for referee. This allows you to offer varying amounts for both the referral and the referee. For example, you can easily offer a higher reward for existing customers to make a referral. Let's save the settings here before we move on. Let's configure the order based rewards. First, you have the option to enable or disable this type of reward. As mentioned earlier, order based rewards are offered when the referee makes a purchase from your store. Next, we have the reward type. Here you have two options fixed and percentage. If you choose the fixed reward type, it will offer the same amount of reward no matter how big or small the order is. If you choose the percentage here, it will calculate the reward amount dynamically based on the total order amount. Then we have the option to set the coupon type. We have two options here, the fixed price coupon and a percentage coupon. Choosing a fixed price coupon gives a coupon that offers a fixed price off, while choosing a percentage coupon gives a coupon that offers a percentage off. Then we have an option to set the set a minimum purchase amount that makes an order valid for receiving, a re for receiving a reward. We can also set the number of number of orders we want to reward. So for example, if we enter 5 here, 5 subsequent orders placed by the referee will be rewarded. Finally, we have the coupon settings broken down into coupon for referrals and coupon for referees. You can enable or disable one of them or offer varying reward, rewards to them. Let's save the changes here and move back to general settings. Now I'll show you how to integrate this plugin with WooCommerce Points and Rewards extension. When you select this option, you'll see a bunch of options appearing under it. You'll see a link over here from where you can configure the integration settings. But before you do so, you'll need to save changes on this page. So let's do it and set up a loyalty points reward. Here you have two types of integration settings. The first setting lets you, choose, lets you offer loyalty points as referral rewards only. While the second option lets you offer loyalty points as referral rewards and also when the customers place orders on a regular basis. Then you have an option to enable sign up points. By enabling it, you can offer reward points for new user sign ups. You can set the number of points you want to reward to both the referrer and the referee. Then you have an option to enable purchase points. By enabling it, you can offer reward points when the referee makes a purchase. Next, you can choose the reward type. You have two options here, fixed and percentage. Choosing fixed here will offer fixed number of loyalty points to the referer and the referee. Choosing percentage on the other hand will calculate the number of points dynamically based on the total order amount. Under this section, we have the usual WooCommerce points and rewards extension settings. You can configure the conversion rate between the loyalty points and your currency, and lots of other customization options. 
to set up a great loyalty program. With the plugin configuration done, let's save the changes here and go ahead and start spreading the word about your referral campaign. Your referral program is no good if your customers don't know about it. Now, let me show you how your customers can get the unique referral link and share it with their friends and family. When a customer opens his account dashboard, they'll see a tab over here in the menu, Referral Link. They can use the social sharing buttons here to share it, or they can just copy and send it via WhatsApp, Gmail, or SMS. Your customers can even keep track of their coupons and points earned through the tabs over here. So that's it. You're now all ready to kickstart your referral campaign and turn your customers into your brand advocates. Enjoy watching your sales climb up and don't forget to give us a review.